so. Well, I, I want to say a worst nightmare. I want to say it's a nightmare. Well, let's just put it this way that something I was thinking about today came true, right? So, I have an Ethiopian friend who's Orthodox, you know. And I used to hang out a lot with her, and she covers her hair. And I loved it, so once in a while I used to cover my hair like this, you know. And usually when I do it, I'm scared to go out because I don't want to be seen as a Somali or something like that, or a Muslim, you know. And most of the time I fear the stereotypes that... In 1,000 feet, turn right on hair. Idaho Avenue East. I don't know what kind of treatment they get, so I've been scared every time I do it. But sometimes, you know, it's easy to just throw the thing on and just go. And um, it saves me time and it helps me get my work done, you know, when I have a bad hair day. So today I was doing it and I was like, oh my God. Um, I had this thought in my head, like, my biggest fear is that... A Somali guy could ask me out thinking that I was Somali and as, as soon as I jumped in the car and I did like my first order with DoorDash I went and delivered it and guess what my worst nightmare came true I mean he's a good-looking guy and everything I thought he was younger you know he was asking me about like a job turn uh, right on my Idaho you know, Avenue East then turn left DoorDash, whatever. and I was telling him and then he was th thinking it was going to be long and I said no it won't be long so um, I said okay if you're worried it'll be long why don't you go to staffing agencies like you can get a job like today and start tomorrow and I was telling him some of the jobs I, I've gotten from them and you know where he could go and out of the blue he asked for my number so um, I know sometimes people just want to hello 